Hello, everyone, and welcome back to a reboot of my series on Crusader Kings 2 on Aragon. It was an update upon on CK2, apparently, and uh, I was going to check, record for another episode, and lo and behold, my save was gone. All of my saves from CK2. Uh, well... We were not too far into the game, we're only 28 years in, and I thought instead of just rushing through and going back approximately to where we were before, to just start over. So, this is what we're going to do. Let's start over, shall we? Let's uh, put our counselors to good use. Uh, you there, Bishop Enrique, you need to like me more so you can give me all of your shekels. I'm gonna increase our relations with Leon. Unless that is Castile doesn't inherit them last time. That was a bit surprising. Uh, ambition. Personal combat skills, that sounds good to me. Hmm. It looks like you would need some extra martial. Hmm. Let's get some uh, hunting going now. Our heir needs to be married. Uh, it'd be good if we could get somebody, something, someone like a Capet. I'm a princess of France. You're going to be betrothed to 11-year-old Emma. There, enjoy, friend. It's not pedophilia if it's if the year is 1066. Now is it? Well, you're just going to be betrothed. You're not going to be married to her, exactly. It'll take a while to do that. Uh, yes, we have Gavelkind. I forget about that. We do need to get our crown authority up, but for that, we do need... Let's increase our centralization right off the bat. And... Uh, there's a save here. I did not get Iron Man. I don't play, I usually try and, I prefer not to play CK2 and Iron Man, I don't, because I, first of all, I don't care that much about the achievements, and also, Iron Man, I've had bad experiences with Iron Man in uh, CK2, like, uh, entire saves just becoming corrupted for some, because of the saves over and over again. We're gonna go... Again, I tried to grab some land right off the bat. Saracusta is very good land. We're going to declare our du jour war for this. Wait, this is the du jour war, isn't it? Yes. And since he's the owner of this, we're going to uh, usurp and take his shit, which is going to be great. Because we'll have to deal with their his ugly infidel ass polluting my holdings. To the good Queen King Sancho. Yes, thank you very much. Of course, I will honor my obligation to call war. Thank you very much. Uh, oh yes, and I also noticed that another good thing to restart this series, I guess, that my sound was a little bit too loud on the other ones. So I'm trying this new setup and see if it's a little bit more bearable. I don't like the. I n I don't like it, and I know that m most people don't like to have the sound being. Over the music being overpowering is it's kind of annoying. Oh yes, this guy wants to marry my courtier. My sister is the steward. You kill them all. Oh lord, that was a bad idea. And they're gonna get there on the sixth of March. Maybe we'll get lucky. I uh, no, I don't think we're gonna get lucky. Nope, we didn't get <laughs> Shit. Shit. Shit, shit, shit. Sister with Navarra or Galicia. I would prefer to get her married to Galicia. We are going to lose that ar a lot of that army. You are now the steward. You go back and you collect your monies. We're going to retreat. Please, retreat. Shit, that was a big mistake. Well, at least we're allied to big allies. He's calling up all these infidels. All his infidel friends. 
Where are they going? Logroño. They're going to try to attack us. This is hills, and we have quite a lot of people here. I think we can stand our ground. Uh, we're so that we have mo low morale, but Infante Ramiro is the one who has the most soldiers here. We're going to try to stand our ground. And hope we don't get too destroyed. Prepare to die, lowborn scum. Oh god, is he gonna kill me? Oh no! <laughs> oh, he died! <laughs> oh, he died. My king died. You better. Oh my god. Oh my god, he died. <laughs> Oh, oh wow! That was a, uh, that was something. Uh, that was really something. Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god! Um, I have to marry you off to someone. Uh, why don't you get married to the king of Navarra? Why not? <laughs> My God! Oh boy. Okay, you need you're an intrigue focus. Uh, go to marshal. I mean hunting, because they'll give you some health and it'll be good for you. Hopefully you won't get killed like your father. That will be very bad because uh, you don't have an heir. Your heir is a uh, infanta. Good Lord. And we are getting destroyed here, aren't we? Jesus Christ. Where are our allies? Gold, one gold or 200 prestige. Yeah, I think the prestige wins out on this. Come on, I want to get married to the King of France so I can have some decent allies. We are taking a beating and my king died. <laughs> my god. Oh, good lord. That was a, that's or that's a much more different start. The start that we had last time was very smooth. This is just ridiculous. We got destroyed. Holy shit! Ay ay ay! No no! Please don't path through the enemy. That is a very bad idea. Vassal levy is racially too long. Ah! Quit your belly aching. Oh my god, they always path. Now I have to restart this. They always path. The, the AI is, tends to path through these this, this, this extremely stupid path. No, please do not separate. You're asking for death. I'm going to Alto Aragon. They're gonna try to siege my shit, are they? No, 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 don't. Oh my god, AI. Just group together, you fools. Seventh of September and eighth of September. Okay, they are going to in there they are. Should try to help them. We have a lot more, it seems. Yep, we're gonna destroy them. They are fucked now. Something finally worked out. Oh my god, that was a, a hundred war score. <laughs> That would have been perfect if we hadn't lost any battles. That would have been instant victory for us, but we got the possibly got the maximum we can. Oh no, we can get more war score of this. Perfect. Enforce demands. Thank you. Thank you for your, your kindness. Vassal inheritance for me. Oh yes. This crap. Can I uh revoke your title? Other vassals by twenty. Eh, my vassals like me, don't they? Eh, I'm gonna revoke his title. Mm. 
It grieves me deeply. I bet it does, friend. Here. Put a rightful Christian in charge of that mosque. Now a church. Now a bishopric. I don't understand why, uh, there really shouldn't be a penalty for revoking, uh, the titles of, there really shouldn't be a penalty for revoking the titles of infidels, I'm thinking. It's kind of stupid if you think about it. It is kind of dumb. Bishop Enrique, uh, probably focus somewhere else. Varela, uh, yeah, I stayed there with Bishop Enrique. He'll be fine. Those you guys need something. You look like you need to just uh, become high almoner and become a little bit happier towards me. Other titles I can give away. Pelayo is almost on the verge of liking me, so let's do that. Uh, you will be master of horse. There, you like me now. Give me more. Give me more of your dosh. We need to get rid of this. He needs to be. He needs to live for at least ten years so he can change the change our succession laws and change that centralization, of course, and get more stuff in our domain. It's early for us to acquire more stuff, but still. And we can't ask them to uh, become our vassal. It looks like, even though they're part of our de jour. We have a de jour claim on this county. Oh, medium crown authority. Well, darn. What do we need for medium crown authority? That's prestige of at least 1,000. Well, we have ways to go then. We are going to uh, be sitting here for quite a while before we change our succession laws. I mean, uh, our uh, our crown authority laws. Oh, infidel revocation. There we go. I think that's why. Uh, yeah, we should probably change that uh, and get it. After we get medium crown authority, we're going to get it for infidels because we're going to be doing a lot of revoking once we go to war with them. If we can't do, uh, if we can't holy war these guys, what about you? We need 200 piety to wage holy war. Oh. The HRE set up an anti-pope. Good for them. It's usually France who sets up the anti-pope, and the pope doesn't really like me. What the hell? Why is this? Well, that was a <laughs> that lasted like two days or something. Justice is arbit arbitrary. Yeah, the Pope doesn't like me very much. But there's no dire need to uh, get him to like us yet, unless he's like really dislikes us. In which case, he might excommunicate us. But we don't seem like we suffer any large threats from the Pope right at this very moment. Is this guy allied to anyone? Emir of Saracusta. Yep, this guy over here. That's the only one that he can call in. I'm going to go to war with him as soon as possible. I would not like to get the de jour one. I prefer to get the holy war. Uh, Yehuda. Okay. Yeah, I prefer to get the, the, the holy war. Because I think that gives us a little bit more prestige. And, uh... Uh, it also allows us to to get direct control over the holding. Heard any good rumors lately? Asked some of your courtiers, will you two engage in idle conversation on day? I've heard others say the same. What? I ate a muddied crab the other day. Horrible meal. <laughs> what a stupid event. I think that's a... Uh, one of Viet's events. I hear a lot of people talking shit about Viet, and uh, I've seen some screenshots from their sh the really shitty events, like the one about the toothbrushing. But uh, I haven't seen that many shitty events. They they, they seem to be quite rare. Uh, the really, oh my god, the really uh, weird events from uh, V I E T. But uh, other things seem fine. They don't seem particularly cringeworthy or terrible. 
Not yet, anyways. Maybe maybe I'll change my mind after a while. Oh, uh, look. Yehudai Ben Saul wants to be my steward. Oy vey. Give Enrique a chance. He's the bishop. I need him to think a little bit highly. Maybe it would be good if we did that. I almost have enough prestige to go. Oh, yes. Uh, I should probably use my court chaplain to convert Zaragoza. Oh, yes. And the, my armor bearer is doing jack shit. And so is my spy master. God damn it. Go get to work and uh, go proselytize in Zaragoza. <clears throat> How is uh, the rest of Europe looking? Fairly normal, what it looks like. Forez is independent. Milan is no longer part of the HRE. Okay. What else is going on in here? The Roman Empire. Oh my god, the Seljuk Empire is revolting. But Fatimids are... Wow, there's revolts everywhere, isn't there? This is a fucking mess. I'm sure Bishop Alvaro is not a heretic. Yeah, leave him, leave him alone. Why do you think everyone has got to be a heretic? Come on now. Calm down. Oh, what's this? Ah, look at that. The defected to Teruel. Or rather, this guy is a rebel. Sheikdom of Teruel. Abdul Hassan. I farted so loudly, everyone must have heard me. <laughs> well, now. That's uh, something. No, he's not at war. What the? Why did this defect to 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 uh, to rule? These rebels are not part of to rule. That is very odd, indeed. I'd like there to be some sort of event that would give me the ability to. Uh, maybe if I create this. Two hundred prestige. I'm ready to go. Yeah, I'll create this. I can use the extra prestige. And just pray that my king does not die. So we can change our succession laws because I absolutely abhor. Oh, I know what we can do to uh, raise my piety. Can I go on a. Um... Uh, where's the. Can't I go on a. Going a pilgrimage. Ah, it's not showing. Well, I guess I can't go on a pilgrimage just yet, maybe. Betrothed can marry. Oh, finally. And there we go. We secured our alliance with the French. And we now have a caput as an ally. Within our lineage, it probably gives us some nice claims over France if we want to press them eventually. If we're able to keep our our marriage ties for longer than just one generation, the Pope is upset with the law free investiture. Fine, uh, I don't want to upset the Pope too much. He already didn't doesn't like me. Oh wow, he doesn't like me at all. Revoked vassal titles, chastised by liege. Oh, it's the guy that thought that uh, was a heretic. Is that you, the court chaplain? Yeah, yes, you are. He's the high almoner already. Ugh, oh, 57 gold. Wow, you're a demanding one, aren't you? I stood by the stained glass windows and tried to look through them. When the priest approached me and asked me what I thought about them, a courtier by my side spoke before I managed to say some very unfair opinions about the multitude of colors used. It saved me, but only for a minute. 
When Alcade Ansur has told the priest what he thought about the stained glass windows, both look inquiring at me until I manage to croak something appraising about the windows, using some of Alcade Ansur's opinions. The priest seems satisfied, and Alcade Ansur beamed at me. Well, that's nice. A little bit of a toady, but. Oh, wow, this guy is uh, really getting destroyed, isn't he? Oh, good. We can finally declare holy war. Which one is best? These are about the same. This will be a little bit better because it'll grant us. Uh, it'll give us more access to other holy wars against this guy, this guy, and these guys over here. So I'm guessing I'm gonna have to go for it to rule itself, holy war. And uh, we're going to call everyone because since this is a holy war. Other people may want to join. Other uh, infidels, Muslims, other Mohammedans might want to join. Oh yes, he wanted to join. We should uh, possibly keep our relations high with the King of France. That would be a good idea. We want him to... Uh, it's called. Yeah, he called him. That's his ally. That's not somebody just joining in. Um, it's okay. Anyone better? No, our commanders are pretty shit. Let's go kill. I don't care about these guys yet. There's their rebels. Sometimes I wonder whether this war we went to. Oh, come on now. The war just started, you pussy. Yeah, pansy. Oh, we got one. We got one. Two of them, actually. Sweet. Fifteenth uh, of August, thirteenth. Okay, we're gonna escape. Good. And we are going to attack them in the plains of all things. Excellent. Just with a river crossing penalty. Not ideal, but. And we wrecked them and got more titles. Let's keep fighting. I am finally a warrior. Ah, good job. Good job. Can you get any better at this? Come a trained fighter. Oh, I can do that. Yeah, France has a lot of troops. Uh, how much, what's your maximum levy? There. 22,000. Yeah, that's quite a bit. That is quite a bit. 6,000. We are up to 22,000. But we're not up to full. We're probably around like uh, 4,000. Still not a lot, but uh, it's not bad, considering we only have about four holdings. For a while, I was a bit unaccustomed to playing an actual Western Kingdom. I played a few games as uh, the old gods start as some of these... Oh shit, attack my, my steward few of these tribes over here I tried off as uh, not as Prussia but as uh, one of the tribes that are the old Prussians force demands and uh, I was always used to how low the in your income is when you're a, when you're a tribal it's just it's just a, you just get used to having this shit absolutely shitty income oh yeah this is the same guy because we usurped what about you? Uh, do you have any allies? You have no allies. You have jack and shit. Oh yeah, there's a Holy War CB cooldown. Uh, we do need to get medium authority up. We need to get our prestige up. So we can... Ref uh, we can... Uh, get the revoke... Get, get Be able to revoke... Uh, people's titles without any penalty if they're infidels. What's the penalty that we get for calling him into the war? Was that too bad? Call into war. Only negative 25. Okay. We should have positive opinions, everyone else. Uh -huh. Protected the suspected. What? Oh. Why did they let me, let me know about this? We're not trying to murder anyone. 
Hold the summer fair. We could try to do some of this stuff. Uh, it's now August. Grand hunt. <clears throat> Get things to raise up our prestige. Oh, good. My, your wife, Queen Emma, has sent you a gift. It is a small puppy, but of the finest pedigree, and destined to grow into a great hunting dog. Aww. Alright, let's try to roleplay a little bit. What's his... He's gluttonous and arbitrary. It's gonna be tricky. Truces are expiring. Excellent. I can probably get some... Oh, it changed color. I, it's still the Banahood Emirate. We can probably get our de jure claim on Saracusta. We're gonna get Huesca for free, and... Uh, we are getting our prestige is going up. Well, we try to get up to a thousand so we can get our infidel revoking. More prestige. Give me all that prestige. I need it. The grand hunt is over for now. Yay. And now we start a feast. Oh, my wife is pregnant. Hopefully it's a male heir. Everybody was talking about the musician. I finally had some time off from my preparation for my feast so I could see with my own eyes and hear with my own ears what people was talking about. What people were talking about, you, you fucking illiterates. Jeez. Ten gold. Send down. Oh, well done for myself. Spent lavishly on food. Yeah, I picked this wife mostly for the alliances because she's not the brightest bulb. Flamboyant schemer. She's barely capable of anything. She's she's just a pretty face, pretty much. Oh, your dog is green quickly and is no longer a little puppy. He runs fast and has a keen nose, and your dog handles praises good character. Good dog. Honest and shy and and paranoid. And fucking just stupid all around. Oh. Good. This is going to be a good feast. Ten prestige. Keep getting me more prestige. Title loss and success. Oh yeah, that's because we don't have a mare. Alright, come on. Give me a male heir. Please, I, I beg of you. My sister. Who is the Sancho of Najera? That's not good. We need to get somebody of our own blood bloodline. Oh, who died? My steward. She's pretty decent, but eh, she's a Muslim, so no. Prefer get the Jew. And all Jew, Jew jokes aside, he is uh, he is he is going to be a steward. So, okay, can't get anything off of these guys. Wow, only the Roman Empire can get more tech, and that's fine. Then. Oh come on, a daughter. It's just like last time. It was a daughter too. Let me check the timer. Okay. not working very well for me. We had some very uh, unfortunate turns of events here. What's going on all over the world? Okay. Wow, this is the the, the southern HRE is just just exploded. This is a disaster. This is a disaster. The Seljuks put down the rebellions it looks like. Uh, the Fatimids did not. Yusuf is now independent, whatever this is. Uh, this is looking fairly common. Bishop Facundo. Oh, he is very good. Yeah, dude. He's my new chaplain. I need good chaplains in order to convert my provinces. Uh, go, go forth and proselytize. 
you go. You must go now. All these people in hiding. In the meanwhile, I guess I can just get a or I can't because of that medium crown. Oil. I forgot about this. I have to raise my crown of three. What is this? <laughs> Against King Robert of Angleterre. Okay. It's the. Uh, one of the England's early wars against France to get back their shit. For France to get back their shit. Alright. Forty piety. Piety and prestige. Oh, and check the time over here. The time is up, so I'm going to cut this episode here and continue in the next one. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate your uh, attention. We'll see you next time over here when we hopefully try to extend our control over the Iberian Peninsula. And hopefully, maybe even become Espana in the future and uh, regain all of the all of the stuff that we lost after my save game died because of the update. Ugh. So, thank you for watching, guys. I hope to see you next time. If you like this episode, please do consider leaving a like and subscribing. Thank you very much, and have a great one.